So today's been another interesting day. I've uh, got a lot of work done back at the office, getting a lot of work done for the people in West Houghton and also a lot of stuff that I need to catch up on at home after the holiday and everything I've been doing since then. Now I'm in Shane here in Manchester, well Salford, to come to Media City. I've actually got quite a way to go yet before I get there. It should be another interesting night. I'm going to go to BBC for Question Time X, which I think is the final one of the series. So that should be good. I don't know whether I'm on the panel or in the audience today because uh, they've told me both. So <laughs> it's only going to be one or the other, I'll tell you that. So we'll find out when we get there anyway. See how it goes. It's a lovely day. Very hot though. I was on a crowded train that was overheated, so I'm feeling a bit sticky though, which is not good. But hopefully I'll be okay by the time we get there because it's a nice breeze. So we can but hope. Let's get going. We're heading there. Let's go. <laughs> we had a nice night actually. I enjoyed the walk. Right, let's go and check in. an amazing turnout, wouldn't you say? <laughs> I'm just doing a quick bit to count. I do a daily video diary. So, looking forward to this. Should be an interesting uh, and lively debate. Really looking forward to it. Um, sorry, there's a woman at the back and this gentleman at the front. So, um, the, the woman at the back, right by you there. Right there. Sorry, go on. What were you, you going to say? Um, hi. I wanted to come back on uh, the comment earlier about uh, trying to take the egg out of the omelette. And in the 70s, I don't recall a vote about us becoming part of an omelette in the first place. It was about a free trade area, not about uh, closer economic union and political union. It was all about free trade. That's what we were voting on. So when the people say now, oh, we don't know what we're voting for when we leave, we didn't know what we were voting for when we came in either. So what so. dish was it we voted for to go in for? <laughs> it wasn't an omelette all mixed up, so what, what was it? A kind it, of a smorgasbord of it, different it, things? Yeah, it, it appeared like we were voting more for joining a buffet or a, a potluck. <laughs> we were bringing something and so other people would bring something and then yeah. you'd, you'd uh, have a mix. Oh, my goodness, it's been such a long day, but... It was great. It was brilliant to be at uh, Question Time Extra Time for what was supposed to be the finale party, but they've added an extra episode onto Question Time for next uh, time, so how it is. But, oh my goodness, the Winter Hill fire, is, the extent of it is very obvious from the fact that the moment you hit the motorway coming back from Manchester into Bolton, all you can smell is smoke from there on in, and it gets worse the further into town you go. I'm choking on it by the time I got home. I'm glad to be indoors now without the windows closed, so the entire place is smoke-free and I recommend you keep your windows closed because of that, because it will cause health problems. But it's no wonder I've been struggling over the last few days, because every time you go outside you're breathing in smoke. Oh, it's not good. I, my heart goes out to all the emergency service people who are still up there struggling with this fire. I hope, I hope they get sorted and they can go home and have a rest soon. Speaking of rest, I'm going to bed now. I'm exhausted. See you tomorrow. <laughs>